pox. You probably had them, I've had them, uh, and we used to go to chicken pox parties, you know? And so we would get him and get it over with. Bill Kunkel says his son Jerome is being discriminated against because of his religious beliefs against a vaccine for chickenpox. Jerome is a student at Our Lady of the Sacred Heart Assumption Academy in Walton, Kentucky. They filed a lawsuit against the Northern Kentucky Health Department. I don't believe in that vaccine at all, and they're trying to push it on us. You know, the chickenpox is uh, a vaccine is derived from uh, aborted fetuses, you know, and of course we're, as Christians, we're against abortion. The Northern Kentucky Health Department mandated that all students without proof of vaccination or proof of immunity against chickenpox will not be allowed to attend school until 21 days after the onset of a rash for the last ill student or staff member. In addition, all school events and extracurricular activities involving other schools or the public will continue to be canceled. Jerome is a basketball player. They say he was told he couldn't play sports, but will be allowed to attend school after the required waiting period. The fact that I can't finish, you know, my senior year of basketball, like our last couple games, is that's pretty devastating. I mean, you go through four years of high school playing basketball, that you look forward to your senior year. Tonight, a meeting was held at Assumption. No comment from anyone here. In fact, we were told to leave. In Kentucky, there is a mandatory vaccination program, and there's an exemption that can be filled out if, for, if you have a religious objection. And in this case, Mr. Kunkel and his parents executed that waiver um, to be able to attend school. It doesn't make no sense, you know, what they're trying to do here. You know, the chicken pox. We're talking about the chicken pox here. I should point out the health department still maintains the vaccination is the best defense against uh, the chicken pox. I should also point out that the school assumption was closed today. The Kunkel family says it, that decision was made after they filed a lawsuit. Still a lot up in the air. A court date is set for April 1st. Reporting live, I'm Curtis Fuller, WLWT News 5. All right, Curtis.